Here's how Peter Schmeichel revolutionised the goalkeeping position. Now, Maynard had signed Schmeichel in 1981 and within a year, he was already seen as the best goalkeeper in the world because of his amazing saves and physical imposing style and his leadership. Now, in 1992, there was a crucial rule change that revolutionised football and this was the removal of back passes. So this now meant goalkeepers had to be good in possession and passing the ball because they can't just pick it up once the defender passes it to them. Schmeichel was the first goalkeeper to recognise a change in goalkeeping was needed for all clubs. He insisted on Sir Alex Ferguson to let goalkeepers train with the main team on passing drills and dribbling drills and not just working on by themselves. Goalkeepers should be a part of the defensive line with their feet and that's how Schmeichel felt. Schmeichel was also revolutionary as he used to charge down the field to pick up loose balls. He was the first goalkeeper to run up for corners if the team desperately needed a goal in the dying minutes. Now Schmeichel wasn't the best with his feet as other goalkeepers like David Seaman were because Seaman had adjusted quicker. But it was Schmeichel who first envisioned the future of where the goalkeeper was going to look like.